Gullo. Let's get them crunk. Chill. Let's get them crunk. Like chip, and chip, subscribe. Chip, Real Murder TV. Chip, chip. Okay, guys, we're going to get into MOB Ruger. Yeah. I'm prepared for the worst, but I pray for better days. I did some shit up in my past, I'm taking to the grave. Okay, guys, I'm going to get into MOB Mob Ruger. You know what I'm saying? One of the originals from the beginning. His brother is Scrap. You know what I'm saying? Got other brothers also. You know what I'm saying? But um, Ruger, one of them them special type of guys that came out man the reason why i say that because he got lucky on a lot of shit everybody around him pretty much was dying getting killed and stuff like that and he able to come out and put his team on mob you know what i'm saying and wreck it i mean right now ain't nobody in the way of ruger right now and Lil mo and the guys you know what i'm saying he on the level right now. He heading on the right path to be where Lil Durk at right now. You know what I'm saying? Because his music is going, you know what I'm saying, going all over the place. Thanks to Kanye. All the celebs starting to click up and link up with um, Ruger. Ruger been just popping, man. He out there getting it. And he said, he tweeted and said Kanye made him a millionaire. You know what I'm saying? Kanye done made this man a millionaire. You know, if Kanye show you Everybody gonna start watching you. They wanna know who the fuck you are. And Ruger just so happened to be a talented rapper and a nigga that was about his business in the street. His brother was that dude, his homie was that dude, and he was related to FBG Duck. You know what I'm saying? It's kinda crazy that Duck died and you didn't get to see the potential that Ruger had. Dusky also, they would have probably moved a little bit smarter if they knew Ruger was gonna go that route. Cause Ruger took off, man. Ruger got hot, man. Ruger was out there, been doing his thing, but nobody was really, the, the internet and everybody wasn't really focused on Ruger. We was focused on Scrap. Ruger came to the front line and put everything on the line. I wish he would have started a little early and got wild the way he did because this dude, man, he go hard, man. Ruger got some nice songs out right now. That No Love, I really love that song. And then he made the GD song. I mean, that I think that made him very, uh, very rich man. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody's saying that now. People are throwing parties, bumping that. My people bumping that. Everybody just going crazy when that song come on. And it, it's starting to get to the, the potential that Fanato had, that Chief Keith had. You know what I'm saying? Um, the GD song going hard in Atlanta, Arkansas, Mississippi. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of places, man. But yeah, Ruger done became a millionaire, man. He close to it if he ain't got it. He, he done became one. But he tweeted and said Kanye made him a millionaire. So, shout out to Ruger, the businessman, first street nigga, to come quick and do it. You know what I'm saying? Chief did it too, but you know, a lot of niggas did it, but you know, Ruger did it out the mud. And he didn't work too hard to get it. Because all the rest of the shit was street shit, you know what I'm saying, they blew up off their street shit, man, and he got in, so now the GD's in the door, I'm so GD, you can see it in my eyes, lately they've been seeing the G's on the rise, like and subscribe, chill, drill music and okay. TV, like and subscribe, ah, ah. chill, drill music, drill music and TV, like and subscribe, like and subscribe, drill music and TV, chill, drill,